visiting Cascade Locks. Yes, it's a place here in Oregon. Um, we've been there a few times. Um, Ted is driving. <laughs> we've been there a few times, but uh, we haven't really eaten there. They have a little ice cream place there that I like going to whenever I'm there. They have the best ice cream cones and I like, you know, getting the ice cream. So I've gotten ice cream and french fries, but today we are actually having lunch um, there. We are really looking forward to it. So we left the house a few minutes ago. It took me like six minutes to clean these glasses because um, I'm not sure if anyone else does this. When you get home, do you just throw your glasses like anywhere? I'm very messy when it comes to stuff like that. We are, take, we are making a stop right now at Platte Pantry. I'm not sure what we are doing, but we are making a stop. <laughs> so we'll be back. So we came back home because it's raining and we forgot the umbrella. So Ted went to grab the umbrellas and we are going to head back out. Okay. We hope that you enjoy this day with us. He's back. You see him back there? Yeah. He went to grab the umbrellas. <laughs> um, yeah. So we can head that now. We got these umbrellas the other day at my job. Um, it's pretty nice so i think we haven't even opened it yet so hopefully nothing is broken inside yeah but anyway follow us So we are on our way. It's raining, 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 raining. But um, I was kind of having a rough day this morning. Uh, so this is nice being able to, you know, step out of the house a little bit. Um, this morning was a bit challenging for me. You know, um, the season in my life right now is a season of change and um, the season of newness and welcoming new energy and just praising God for what I have and be more grateful for every single blessing that he has brought my way and so this morning uh, was one of those mornings where I actually was seeing the change that is going to happen you know more physically you know and so it was a bit difficult I'm, I'm praying God I'm praying to God and trusting God for everything you know what I mean um I'll be able to talk more about this in the future maybe in, the, in our next video or something but right now this moment right now i'm just very grateful to god for every single opportunity every blessing every change taking place in my life and just very grateful i'm grateful even for the rain that is coming down you know what would we be without the rain and so it's going to show you that i'm saying this just to say that i'm just grateful for every single thing and you know, I just want to remind you to just, you know, to live in your truth and to constantly be happy and just trust God for every single thing that you are currently experiencing in your life. Yeah, I'll talk more about about it later, but that's where I am right now. Um, I'm breaking out um, a lot, but actually I'm recovering from the breakout, um, from dealing with all this stress in the past few weeks and whatever has been happening. Um, yeah, but it's raining. <laughs> it's wonderful. I don't even know what they serve here, so I hope we're not making a mistake. Um, let's see what they serve, and then if not, we just leave. So we just got here to Cascade Locks, and we found this restaurant. This is the first one we are going to check out. It's called Bridgeside Family Dining. Uh, we don't know what they serve, so 
we are really taking a chance here. It's raining and I'm wearing the wrong thing today. Um, but there's a car coming, let me move before I get knocked down. Yeah, but we are gonna see what kind of food they, are, they serve here and hopefully we can enjoy it. Let's go in. So we just got here and you have to actually sit yourself. So we found a table by the window and right now we have water. Um, I ordered a milkshake, but waiting for the food, patiently waiting. I'm so hungry and I can't wait to devour what is coming. I'm going to literally devour. Here's Ted, very handsome. There are guns on the wall. There are. I want to turn the camera around, but I don't want to look at people eating. Yeah. But there are guns on the wall. I don't want to record people, so I'm not going to... Old rifles. Old rifles, yes. People are eating, and I don't want to... I don't like being recorded when I'm eating, so I don't want to record anyone else. So that, take Ted's word for it. There are old rifles on the wall. Oh, there are some all over. So we are done having lunch. Um, right next door to the restaurant, they had this um, store. So we came in. It's like a general store of some sort, you know. So we came in to just check it out. I just like this one, the pig pushing the wheelbarrow. Yeah. It's 29 bucks. What happened? I like that for my garden. They said that these things are dream catchers. I actually don't know what that means. Like, what does it mean? Can someone tell me what it means? Okay. As a Native American legend is told by hanging a dream catcher over your sleeping area, the bad dreams will be deterred by the dead in the feathers will attract and allow by the, the bead bead okay by the bead in the feathers will attract and allow the good dreams to pass through huh interesting i've seen them around people's houses even their cars but i didn't know what it was okay okay well, well now i know i like these coffee mugs they are very cute my sister-in-law Ashley gave me a coffee mug that looks just like this one, but it's pink. I'm actually going to start using it. I haven't used it yet because it's so cute and I don't want to break it. They have some jam. Yeah, it's a cute, generous stuff. They have some books, the Bible, the power of prayer by Ian Bounce. Yeah, it's a generous store, so they have everything. Yeah. So... Getting some coffee. Okay. The place is called Thirsty Coffee Bar. Let's see what they got. I don't see him. Oh, he just chased the people off. Hi guys. Hello, Hi. how are you? So we get this cute coffee shop. It's called Thirsty. I ordered a caramel macchiato and Ted ordered the usual black as it can be for <laughs> coffee but uh, it's, a, it's the cutest place ever um, I like the lights in here one day hopefully I can own a place like this it's perfect it's perfect it's so cozy in here and just like so cute so we are having some coffee um, got myself some caramel macchiato and Ted has just black coffee but just hanging out today, not doing much. Talking and just relaxing and trusting God for everything. Here he goes. He's so handsome, isn't he? Oh, I just need to look good. <laughs> um, but we hope you guys are having a great day as well. Um, it's still raining out, so um, how many things have we done today? Well. 
food. We went to this gift shop and then now coffee. I don't know what we got for this when we are done here, but um, if it wasn't raining, we'll probably have walked around and showed you guys around. But we will be back in Cascade Locks to hang out and we'll show you guys on non, a non raining day. Yeah. But anyway. Okay, guys, we hope that you enjoyed this video. Yes, yes, yes. Honey, how did, how did you feel on that day? It was a nice little trip. We mm -hmm. needed to get out of the house. It was raining a little bit, mm -hmm. and we made the most of it. We ended up eating at a restaurant, family restaurant, fried food. It was okay, but yeah. we were kind of looking for something a little bit different. But a little bit there different. were about two or three other places to go to there, and we'll certainly be returning. Mm -hmm. The coffee shop was probably the highlight of the trip yes mm -hmm. and we'll it? be going back to ride the stern wheeler too which mm -hmm. is a boat that travels up the columbia river gorge so that'll be an upcoming video certainly yes it was actually a very uh, nice day for me because i love the rain it just kept raining it was just really really nice it wasn't like strong rain i don't like like strong rain i just like light rain and that's exactly what we got on that day the rain was just perfect and we went to this cute coffee shop and they actually had a bible on the table it was just really exciting we hope you enjoyed this video as always we needed to get out we needed to de-stress and mm -hmm. it's a really important thing to do in a relationship and in life in general whether mm -hmm. you're in a race relationship or not so it, it was definitely something that helped us to recharge yes. get our minds straightened and gave us a moment together to connect Mm -hmm. don't forget to subscribe and like Televero TV as always we love you, we appreciate you and don't forget to leave a comment below to let us know how we are doing and how you are doing and tell us if you need any prayer and we will still stay in prayer with you we love you and appreciate you so much bye 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 bye